So, it's Merry Christmas to the Hemachet uh, locals. I'm here with uh, Michael, fame of uh, Mike on Monday, when they can be bothered, even though it's a Tuesday, and, uh, and Chris, Mike's friend. So, um, we're talking about the, uh, the game tonight. Uh, Mike, happy? Oh, uh, I, I, I saw what you said you were going to say. <laughs> yeah, I mean, if you'd have said, I would have been a hand up basically for a point before the game. I think we could have won it. I think, uh, I think that um, they had all of the ball but created very little with it. And I think that we had very little of the ball and, and did pretty well when we did have it. We were in the second half, we had what, a ball that shot cleared off the line. Um, and we hit the crossbar. crossbar and um, in the first half, I thought I saw it better actually. I thought that actually got worse as the game went on and we, we grew into it. I'll tell you something. For the last 10 minutes, when they should have been looking for the win, we were the team in charge of the game, so we're fitter as well. Yeah, yeah, that, that, um, that, 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 that was very, very um, obvious um, and very, very encouraging as a West Ham fan with the fact that we... Yeah, yeah. We were playing through the middle all the time and I, I thought we, you know, we, we could, have, could have nicked it, but we couldn't finish it. We had all the possession, but we just couldn't finish it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. So, so Chris same is going to same old story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same so, old story. So, so okay. So, so okay. So, so what do we need to do? Um, from you know, so we've had a pretty good three games. You know, we're on an equal goal difference. Four points out of those four. Sorry, four points out of those three terrible games that we talked about. Um, but we've got four points. Um, we're on equal goal difference. What do we need to do? to take that kind of um, performance into producing points against your Stokes, your West Broms, and your Newcastles. Well, that's a good point, isn't it? I mean, let's face it, I, I, we all thought as West Ham fans we were going to get nothing out of Man City away and then home to Chelsea and Arsenal. We came out with four points from those games, which is four bonus points if you want. But it count, counts nothing if we don't get anything away at Stoke and then home to Newcastle and then West Brom. So well. what does Moyes need to do differently? He needs to play a midfield. Um, mm. 8-0-2 is fine defensive formation against like uh, if you're hanging on against who let's face it a superior team if you look at the players they've got in their lineup mm. the team at Arsenal but I mean ultimately where this is where we found out where Moyes is I'm quite impressed with him so far uh, against stronger opposition yeah. but if you look at the only time he's really had to play someone who is uh, 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 of a level that we should be like Everton we are absolutely tonked and um, so I'm really interested to see what happens now. He's going to be found out. And the, he really, this, these are more important almost. I mean, it's great. It's brilliant with me, Chelsea. I was there and it's a wonderful occasion. Even tonight, I thought we played really well. We worked really hard. We looked fitter and all the rest of it. But we have to beat. We need four points from the two games between Stoke and Newcastle. And as you said, and I agree with you, seven between Newcastle, West Brom so, and Stoke. Does he start with Chikorito next game? Question. It, it depends how fit Chikorito is. Uh, no. I would, because we haven't got us. We had three strikers on the bench. We had four, if you include Ayu, and two yeah, defenders. Yeah, 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 and yeah, that yeah. said a lot. And yet we had no midfielders on the bench. Yet we were playing two midfielders, basically, up front. And that's very, very weird to mm. me. Having said that, Alnautovic was outstanding tonight. It, it was fantastic, wasn't he? Yeah, 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 really good. Me, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I gave it to Adrian, but I mean, I would go with Alnautovic in yeah. there. And, um, but Antonio, and even though I can see why he's there, he's got the first touch of an oak tree. It just bounces <laughs> straight off him. Do you know what I mean? It just, and, no, and yeah. like, he, he hasn't got the composure you need to play there. He's a winger, basically. He's it. a winger. Out he's a position. winger. He's yeah. a good, strong, big winger. Damn fine I, I winger. Love the guy. Yeah, yeah, and he yeah. worked really hard, worked really, really hard. Yeah, really, yeah, yeah. really put himself into it 100%. And I've got, I'm not knocking him. But we really need a forward there. And we need, trying to, I mean, we've got, we've got massive hole in midfield anyway. We yeah, really yeah, yeah. Need some midfielders. Okay. So, Newcastle. 23rd. Um, we're all here. Um, we're all here for a good old piss up. Um, should we win that game, New Newcastle? Yeah. yeah. We have to win that game. I mean, they're in 
deep doo doo land, and uh, we're in deep doo doo land. So you need to be deep doo 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 yeah, land. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do, that's where the, that we finished with that last season, and that's why we finished eleventh because we were being absolutely torn apart. And the five one, you were here yeah, with me <laughs> last season for the five one humiliation. And, and the point tonight, it means there's nothing if we don't mm. beat uh, Newcastle. I know yeah. okay, they're in the championship uh, uh, last season, but you know, we were beating Burnley and something of those teams here at, at the London Stadium yeah. last season. And that's what Billich worked out. And to his credit, he knew that we needed to win those things. And we need to win those kind of games. Sadly, I, I, he was quite happy. Or was yeah, quite I happy. totally agree. I, I think we need seven from the last, sorry, seven from the next three of those so-called winnable games. We got, was it um, Stoke, Newcastle and West Brom. So we need seven, I think. Yeah. I yeah, know. we need seven. So, okay. We, we need seven, at least five. How do we get five? Is that, are we, oh, I win two draws. Okay, so <laughs> fucking hell, my, 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 my mathematics. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, boys, um, so um, we have done this uh, as, a, as, a, as a kind of um, half arse hammers chat in, in Gonzo's absence. Um, and it's lovely. It's a, look, you've got a big tree there. There you go. So, yeah. So um, this, is for, this is for you, Gonzo. We, uh, we miss your nose and. Um, yeah, a bit, a bit of a drunken event, but um, yeah. So um, anyway, we're quite happy, here, guys. Um, we're really happy. Well, we're not we're not really happy. We're happy. It's um, it's it's good, you know. Yeah, we yeah, we're quite happy. Um, it could have been worse. But anyway, um, good night, all, and um, fuck off. <laughs>